Question number six. The diagram shows a circle with center O radius 10 centimeters. The code AB divides the circle into two regions whose areas are in the ratio 1 is to 4. And it is required to find the length of AB. The angle AOB is in pi radians. Show that pi is equal to something. Show that uh, theta, theta radians. So this is theta radians. Show that theta is equal to 2 fifth pi plus sine of pi. And for the second part, we need to show all our workings and use the iterative formula based on the equation part 1 with initial value of x is equal to 2.1 to find theta correct to two decimal places. Hence, find the length of AB in centimeters correct to one decimal place. Okay, good. So now, we need to show that um, theta is equal to 2 fifth of pi plus sine of theta. We know that the area here is 1 and this is 4, two segments. Right, so how can we find the area of this segment? It is basically the area of the sector minus the triangle. It's like this. We want to find this area, the segment. So I'm going to take the whole sector minus the triangle. So the sector is um, area of minus sector half r squared, half times 10 to the square times theta, which is then 50 theta. Then area of triangle, half AB sine C, half times 10 to the square multiplied by sine of theta, which is 50 sine of theta. Therefore, this is the minor segment for the minor, minor, segment we're going to take the minus sector minus the triangle so what is the minus sector the minus sector is uh, 50 theta minus the area of the triangle 50 sine of theta so this is uh, centimeter square this is the area of the small segment here now we need to find the area of um, the major segment this is basically the major sector, this, this, this here, major sector, plus the triangle. So major sector, the area will be uh, half r square, so that is half times 10 to the square times. This angle here, the whole angle is 2 pi, so we get 2 pi minus theta to get the reflex angle here. So that's going to be then 50 into 2 pi minus theta. Now, what is the area of the triangle? We found it earlier on. So the area of the triangle was 50 sine theta. Therefore, the major segment is going to give us the triangle plus the sector here. So the triangle is then 50 sine of theta plus the major sector 50 minus 2 uh, 15 to 2 pi minus theta right so from here we got the major segment so we can factorize yeah got then plus 2 pi minus theta inside good centimeter square we know that this area is compared to this area this area here is 4 times the other one 4 is to 1 so this is 4 times this, I can factorize this as well, 50 can go outside, so 50, and then multiply by 4, because it is 4 times, the uh, 4 times this is going to give us the area of a major sector, a major segment, into theta minus 50 sine, of, sorry, theta minus sine of theta, because we factor 50, 50 goes out, there, here we are. And all of that is going to be equal to 50 times sine of theta plus 2 pi minus theta in brackets. 50 and 50 can go out. 4 times theta is 4 theta. Oh, right. Uh, minus 4 times sine of theta minus 4 sine of theta is equal to sine of theta plus 2 pi minus theta. 4 theta, theta. So I can do 4 theta plus theta is equal to sine of theta plus 4 sine of theta. 
that's going to give us 5 sine of theta okay of course plus the 2 pi right so 5 theta 5 sine of theta plus 2 pi and theta is equal to then 5 over 5 is 1 1 times sine of theta is sine of theta plus 2 pi over 5 2 pi over 5 this 5 goes there divides alright so we have it then 2 fifth of pi plus sine of theta here we are here we are shown now for the second part we need to uh, use the uh, initial value of x is equal to 2.1 use the iterative formula here to find theta correct to two decimal places so first of all I'm going to use the initial value 2.1 so we're going to say then theta is equal to 2 fifth of pi plus sine of 2.1 we need to give the result of each uh, iteration um, I don't know, it's not mentioned in the question. Maybe correct to four decimal places. Okay, so I'm going to choose it myself, four decimal places. So let's move on. Two fifth of pi. So two over five multiplied by pi is going to give us this much plus sine of 2.1. So the first one is 2.1198. So again, two over five pi plus this time sine of 2.1198. And we're going to check that out. So 2.2 over 5 is like uh, 0 0.4. So that's 0 0.4 pi plus sine of 2 double 1 9 8. That gives us 2.109, 2.1097. And again. Okay, so we're going to say sine of 2.1097, right, plus 0 0.4 pi, 2.11, 49, 2 over 5 pi, sine of 2.1149 is equal to 2.1149. Alright, Nicole, so let's take a look at uh, this one, 2 over, f mm, 2 over 5 pi times sine of 2.1122, so sine of 21122 plus 0 0.4, 0 0.4 pi, and it's going to be 2.1136. Now, what can we observe? 2.11, it's all converging to 2.11, therefore, I can confidently say that um, theta is going to be 2.11 to two decimal places as required by the question. Now we need to find the length okay, of AB. So how we can find the length? I'm going to squeeze it here. All right. So the length of AB, AB is going, is going to be, we can use cosine rule. Okay, maybe I'm, I need more spaces here. All right. So I need to find AB. It's A B two point one one and uh, we got this as ten ten right so cosine rule so we're gonna say a b to the square is equal to ten to the square plus ten to the square minus two times ten ten square times cos of two point one one. So I'm gonna say hundred hundred is two hundred minus two hundred cos of two point one one. So um, 200 okay minus 200 times cos of 2.11 it's going to give us wow hang on cos of 2.11 okay times 200 it's going to give us this much right okay good 
and I'm going to take 200 minus the answer 302. This was all right. 302.6905 and so on. Therefore, AB is going to be the square root 3026905. Square root of the answer is going to give us 17.3. 9, 8, and so on. Therefore, AB is going to be approximately 17.4 centimeters. Here we are for the third part of this question, taken from June 2011, Advanced Level Maths, HSC P3.